Hello, this is a quick overview video of the Cotraco Portasonic 2-point flow. The Portasonic 2-point flow ships with the main unit, a pair of DM10 standard flow sensors, a pair of beaded chain clamps, which clamps the flow sensors onto the pipe as you can see here, a wall thickness gauge sensor, some silicon grease, and a measuring tape. I will now show you the basic features of the Portasonic 2-point flow. The easiest way to start your flow measurement is the quick start menu option. You are then required to input your transducer type. WTG is the wall thickness gauge probe that we supply. Now the Portasonic 2-point flow also doubles up as an ultrasonic thickness gauge, allowing you to measure wall thicknesses of your pipes that you are testing. The DM10 sensor is the standard sensor type that we supply for flow measurements. After you've selected your sensor type, you're then required to input your transducer mounting options. W is for small pipes, V is the default method, and if you're just not sure what to use, use auto and allow the software to calculate it for you. Then you're required to measure your pipe diameter then your pipe wall thickness, as explained earlier, you can use the wall thickness gauge to judge this. And then you're required to select the pipe material from a list of predefined materials already saved in the database. If your pipe material is not in the database, you can select other and put in your own custom material. Likewise, the same applies for liner material where you can select your custom material if you're not sure. And finally, your fluid type and you can select it from a list available here. If your fluid type is not present, you are allowed to select other and input your own custom fluid. Enter your fluid temperature, confirm your sensor type and then install your sensor according to the spacing here. The sensor installation process is covered in a separate video, so I will skip that in this video. And I will move on to the sensor measurement screen where I've also explained in the other video and we will now go straight into the flow measurement screen and I will talk you through some of the features present in the Portasonic 2-point flow. The Portasonic 2-point flow is able to calculate energy flow rate as you can see here. The unit present on the screen is gigajoules but you are able to change it to kilowatt hour, kWh or BTU units which are more familiar to some customers. There are a range of different parameters that are displayed in the Portasonic 2-point flow. You can see your temperature, your pipe area, your signal to noise ratio and various different measurements, your ETA-ATA which is related to your signal strength, the delta time, the transit time, Reynolds number, K factor, your corrected flow rate, more details, and finally your flow rate and your net total from the totalizer function. The Portasonic 2-point flow has a remarkable amount of features and will be able to meet your requirements. Thank you very much.